Hi, it's Sophie Keen Trunk here with yet another attempt at cider review. Cider I'm going to review just now is a South African cider. First for me, it's a Savannah Drive. It's a 5.5 in a Richter scale. As I said, it is a first for me, South Africa. Not a country I would associate with uh, making cider, but let's see what it has to offer. Let's spark it open. There's a wee bottle cap there. The old Safana Dry. The old uh, BB Bar Fly let me down there. With a big dent in it. So, anyway, here's the pour. The Safana Dry. Nice golden uh, colour to it. Nice gold, actually. I would class that as well gold. A hazy carbonation about it. Seems to be taking its time to make its way to a so called head, but it's all about the, the aromas and the tastes and whatnot. So, anyway, let's get in here and see what we can come up with. Got a light, uh, dry smelling apple aroma from it. So it smells very, very nice, very pleasant. So anyway, it's all about the taste. So, sofa can drunk. I'll go in here for the Savannah Dry, Slangy Van, South African style. Mm. That is very, very nice. Very sessionable. 5.5 in the Richter scale. I do know that uh, when you're drinking this in the pubs, they put a, a wedge of lemon in it. A bit like your, uh, your Mexican beers, they put a bit of lime. I've never seen that uh, before uh, with ciders, but they do serve it with uh, wedges of lemon. I was in the pub recently in the Count House in Glasgow and uh, I was asked, when I asked for a Savannah Dry, would I like some lemon with it? And I said, yes, I would. And it was served in the neck of the bottle. Just, you just wedge it in there at the top. Uh, and then it's up to yourself if you push it in or drink it through the lemon. A bit like the Mexican beers, but I tell you, it's very, very pleasant. I would say it's one of those ones, like a lot of these... Uh, Ciders, um, drink it over ice, very, very pleasant, very nice. South Africa is a country I would not associate with making cider. So, anyway, the Savannah Dry, the premium cider, that pre premium brand seems to be just slapped willy-nilly onto a lot of stuff now but I suppose it's it's okay with that. It doesn't really tell you a lot about it actually there's not much information about it at all. It just says it's a product a product of South Africa and it's got a website www.savannah.co.za well Check it out actually for cider. It's actually not that too bad. It is one you could session on. It's one for the ladies, I think. Uh, it's got a nice, a, a nice, uh, what, would, what would you say, a sessionable uh, one for the ladies. That's all it's, it's, it's got a nice, uh, nice apple throw. It's not too overpowering and it's just lovely and it's 5.5 on a Richter scale so it's one you should really look out for actually even the cider drinkers use guys out there as well who like their ciders it's, I wouldn't dismiss it, it's quite nice mm. it's crisp basketball well. so anyway it's a fan of dry 5.5 on a Richter scale I'm going to give my a Sofa King drunk rating of 3.5 out of 5. 
it's actually quite nice so look out for it so anyway if you had the old savannah dry leave a comment if you stuck around to the end of the video thanks for doing so i'll see you on our side of you cheers for now slang ciao